Hey guys, it's Mr. Wedge, and today we're going to paint that uh, clay gargoyle we made. So I'm going to protect my table because I'm going to be using silver acrylic paint, and then we're also going to need black tempera paint. So acrylic, as soon as it dries, it turns to plastic, so you've got to be really careful. But I've got silver acrylic and a clean brush, and I'm just going to paint the whole clay sculpture first. And you can even paint the bottom because it's not glaze. You know, when we use glaze on clay, we don't paint the bottom because um, it'll fuse to the bottom of the kiln. It'll stick to it because glaze actually melts and turns to glass. And that's why when you make a clay sculpture, you don't glaze the bottom. But this is paint, so it's okay. Just paint the whole thing, and as soon as it's done, we'll let it dry and move on to the next step. You really want to get everywhere when you do this, so make sure you poke the brush into all the little holes for like, the mouth and the eyes. And just make sure you cover every little area of clay so there's no more. And when it's done, we'll set this aside to let that dry completely. And now I'm going to go wash my hands and my brush really well. Well, my gargoyle's all dry and now it's all silver. So I'm going to get some black tempera paint, put it on a paper plate. I got my brush all clean and dry. And this part is really messy, but you got to just be brave and trust it. So now I'm just going to paint my whole gargoyle with black tempera paint. But I'm not going to let this one dry. I'm actually going to brush it off before it dries. So same thing as before, you want to poke the paint into all the little nooks and crannies and holes that you have. And just make sure the whole sculpture is covered. And it's going to get on your fingers. That's okay. It's tempera. We can wash it off. So once you're done painting it, just grab a paper towel. We're just going to wipe all the black paint off, but it's, it's going to stick in those little holes and cracks and things. So it'll look like old stone. Just a cool way to paint a sculpture. So it's got to be metallic acrylic paint first. Let that dry. And when it's dry, you paint on top of it with tempera paint. And some of the shine comes through in some places. And then it's covered up in other places and it gives it this really nice texture. And then when that's dry, your sculpture's finished. So there's a gargoyle sculpture. So work hard, have fun.